Ball! Ball! Can I throw the ball again? Nope. Ball's done. The ball is done. Speak. You told me this morning that we'd be spending the day as pirates. I would have thought you were crazy. Yeah, I probably look like a loser, huh? No, not at all. Not even if you tried. You could never be a loser. Even if you tried. Well, yeah. The best friend code requires you say that. <laughs> it's just... This whole day has made me feel like a little kid again. I can't believe we were eight and nine when we planned this. I can. This tiny kid's head is squeezing the shit out of my head. <laughs> <laughs> well. Well. Should have upgraded. Lead the way. <clears throat> what if I speak to her again? I'll hold a ship down. Okay. Here you go. Here's some tape. Aye. Pirate's tape. Ahoy, Bluebeard. I have brought the stickiest tape in all the seven seas. Well done, fellow scallywag. Just like old times. Yar. Remember how we used to talk about ruling the bays of Arcadia one day? <laughs> I thought we were going to be pirates forever. We still are pirates. Does being a pirate means acting silly and going on crazy adventures together. Then we'll always be pirates. Hell yeah. Yep. All right. So, how does this lead us to a treasure? Exactly. Would you like to do the honors, Long Max Silver? It'd be me pleasure. Are you sure? Of course. Come on, navigator. Point me to some treasure. Yar. All right. Where be the treasure? Wait. How am I supposed to use this? The drawing I... on the lens. It should line up with something. Something. Okay. Goes now. Right. Okay. Oh. The drawing is supposed to uh -huh. be something. Yeah. Okay. Um. Huh. Okay. So I'm very limited on my uh, where I can point this thing. Keep the drawing. I was trying to see if I could get up to the light post because uh, this thing on the left looks kind of like a light post. It also almost looks like an umbrella as well. But, um, no. Uh, okay. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. No, maybe. No, I have no idea what I'm doing here. I can't line it up with anything. Oh, maybe spin the lens. I didn't realize I had to spin the lens game. Is that it? Uh, nope. Okay. Uh, cloud? The, the, oh no, this is... Okay. Everything was upside down. The whole damn thing. Now it looks much more like a real location. I... Could it be a boat? Here? Upon the, the, the fence? No? Maybe? Probably not. Miss? No? Maybe? Wait. Got Damn it! it. <laughs> you rock! Where is it? Here? Two paces to your right. Okay, take a step right. Paces! Oh, no, 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 my right. The other right. My other right or your other right? My other right. My other right. Got it. Wait, what? <laughs> Just go. The other direction. That way. There you go. Perfect. Now come towards me. Perfect. Bingo. X marks the spot. Well, don't lose your place. 
we actually buried it in the yard. I thought we would have, like, just hid it somewhere in the house. But actually burying it. Huh. Very innovative for 8-year-old and 9-year-old Max and Chloe. We've hit treasure. Either that or Bongo's coffin, but I really hope it's treasure. What the... That is not what we buried. Oh. Well, that's interesting. A twist. Who dug up our treasure and buried a barrel in its place? What is this? I, I don't know. Let's open it. Oh. It's interesting. <gasps> From Bloody Bill. <laughs> Oh my god, William! Oh, it's your dad! That is adorable! Fucking William! God! Dad is such a goof Son of a bitch! Game. Son of a bitch! Really? That is awesome! He put it in a barrel and buried, reburied it. Walkers, <laughs> it's me, Putty Bill, the Pirate King. <laughs> what the heck? I know you've seen that I dug up your treasure. Yeah. Would normally make us mortal enemies, but hear me out. I haven't pilfered a thing. On the contrary, I figured you swashbucklers might not be back to your loot for some time. So he's rehit it. Friendship, love. Your Oregon State prepaid college. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna go with Chloe and say friendship. <sighs> God damn it, William. Huh, yeah. I guess it probably would have gotten ruined underground. Eh, possibly. <laughs> Holy crap! It's Billy the Squid. Oh, man! It really is. Yeah. Oh, look at this. We wrote each other letters. <laughs> <laughs> Holy Christ. Thanks, Max. <laughs> I hope you are having a lot of fun being a teenager with your best friend. Aw. So she still is. Damn. Adorable. Oh, vaccine. <laughs> How are you today? I am doing very well. It is Friday, June twenty seventh, two thousand three. It is a summer vacation. It is summer vacation. We are making a time capsule for you and me in the future. We are making it pirate themed. Wasn't it hilarious to find? These are some things we like: favorite animal, Arabian horse. Max, otter. Chloe. Favorite food: lobster roll. Max, coffee, ice cream. Chloe. Favorite class in school, art or library, Max, science, Chloe, those still stay true. Best friend, each other, both. How about you? Are you age 12 or more? What are your favorite foods, movies, etc.? That's all for now. I hope you are having a lot of fun being a teenager with your best friend. Sincerely, Maxine Caulfield. <laughs> Adorable. How about mine? What did I write? Well, let's find out. This is so Chloe. Oh, am I Maxine? <laughs> Dear Maxine, hello from 2003. Here is a record of how we spend our days. Can you guess which one is real? We go to the same school and always sit together at lunch. Duh. We have sleepovers at least once a week. We like extremely salty pretzels. We are in a race to see who can convince your parents to get a pet first. And we are going to live together when we can afford it. And... And use only gold paint. We have battled many foes and never failed to save each other. What did you guess? If you guessed all of them, you are right. Your friend forever, C 
Chloe Elizabeth Price. <laughs> you were really sweet. Oh man, I was really goofy. I like it. That's because you're a goop. <laughs> this is so cool. There's so much to look at. Yeah. Is your mom going to mind about this mess? If she does, no. we can make her walk the plank. Oh, so today's the day it happens. Wait. I'm gonna draw something. We were baking before he left, or we were cooking before he left. So, gimme, 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 gimme. I want to look at everything. I want to look to see if we left things out. This is probably the last thing Chloe's mom wants to see after a shift at the diner. Yeah. I can't tell if this is what uh, we left from when we were cooking. Because if you remember from the original game, when we had flashed back to this day, you know, um, we were cooking with William and Which then he, he got the call to go. Hey, come on now. I always look especially short next to Chloe. <laughs> always have, always will. All right, we can look at that the phone. Day. Listen to the message. I used every possible excuse to be here for breakfast. Good luck, hub. Good luck, hubby. We're so proud of your promotion. You get a week of two whale waffles in your own house. Your loving wifey. Adorable. Bulletin board. Chloe's grandparents live in Idaho now. I guess compared to that, Seattle's not so far. Yeah. Umbrella. Ace used to make great pirate swords. Still can. Goodbye, Vase. Soon you won't have to worry about me knocking you over anymore. Knock it over much there, Max? That's the voicemail Chloe's mom was talking about. But we'd have she to distract her. She didn't want Chloe to hear it. Ugh. If Chloe's in trouble at Blackwell, this might be my only chance to get her to talk about it. <sighs> Let's move on. It's good to see you, old friend. Billy the Squid. Recording things was so much fun in third grade. <laughs> actually, I to call after or you could just fucking text her, call her, really talk to her. To <laughs> Most of these are pretty far off things. Predictions so the for the future. Maybe it's better to enjoy the present instead. I swear to God, if one of these is... Like Max has powers, I'll lose my shit. By Chloe and Maxine, we still hang out with each other more than with any other person. Both of us are medium popular. Both of us are dating our second boyfriend. We do not make decisions without consulting each other. The talking skull of our enemies. Both of us have a pet. Chloe has visited Antarctica. Max could rave. Could have come if she wanted. One of us has a little sister or brother. We are doing well in school. Some of those came true, I guess. These are awesome. The school one, possibly. Chloe's always been good at making up cool things to do. The chopper switches pedals from wheels to blades. World's most comfortable seat and also spins blades. Okay. Flaming fingers. Flint and steel. <sighs> Love it. Ray of sunshine. Sunlight enters here. Mirrors and lenses to strengthen sunlight. Laser beam shoots out here and opens intake window. Awesome. Very good. Holy crap. It's the end of that comic in Chloe's room. <gasps> this is gross. Maybe you should come down and power up. Wait. Maybe you should come down and power of flight this dude's face off with me. <laughs> so that's what Chloe decided to fly down to do. She didn't fall from the sky. 
I see. Okay. This container looks like it could last a hundred years. Sorry, Chloe, I, I interrupted you. What did you what are you saying? Snuggle up. Shake it. Shake that dough. Just think, in like ten years? No. In five mm -hmm. more years? Now you've got something pretty to look at. You'll be sitting inside of that thing. Looking out on this exact day. Aren't you cold in there? And freaking the fuck out about the situation you're in. You sure were troublesome to find. Not really. That's so cool that Chloe's mom is thinking about this. Awesome. Stories about women changing careers in midlife. Hey look, it's our wine spot. Chloe and I spilled that wine months ago. I still feel bad about it. Chloe. Look. Chloe looks so content when she's drawing. Is that what I look like when I'm taking pictures? Most definitely. Oh, hell yeah. Pose Take with Chloe. A break for a second. This artist waits for no stop. Another picture. She's gonna catch on eventually. <laughs> Why are you taking all these pictures? Shut the fuck up, phone. Why are you taking all these pictures of the two of us? It's not like we're not gonna see each other. I still haven't told Chloe about my Yeah. I can do that after I finish looking at everything. Right. I hope Chloe's parents never get rid of that swing set. I don't think they have. Hey, what if my being in Seattle finally convinces Chloe to try an MMO? <laughs> and you call her the nerd? I mean, don't get me wrong, I've played MMOs, but oh, you know. Oh, it's so adorable little kids! Maybe I'm worrying too much about this move changing things. Wait, were they going trick-or-treating as chocolate chip cookies that is fucking adorable or an ice cream sandwich one of the two because I mean they have to they have to constantly be walking around like that though in order for people to figure out that they're an ice cream sandwich but awesome either way adorable little kids oh look at them okay cool <laughs> Allowance budget. Looks like Chloe's a lot more responsible than I am. Wow. She gets an allowance of eleven dollars, oddly. That's very strange. <laughs> okay, sure. Gift from grandma. Cool that she's, you know, saving some. The lighthouse of evil. I bet there's some really cute photos in there. Take a look. I wonder if I could recreate this photo with Chloe now. Well, you could. You can't tell her the news or listen to the phone message if we do that. But we most certainly could. And here's the hat. Photo. Hat. Jump on yes. the jump on the couch. Pose for a photo with that. Okay. Tip your head back and put your arms out. And a really big smile. <laughs> <laughs> like this? There you go. Perfect. Stop moving. Oh, it's adorable. Really cute, Chloe. You're not so bad yourself. Thank you. Okay, so we recreated it. Anything I else? I can't decide which version of this photo I like better. Let's take a look. I think the other one, personally. Talk to Chloe. A note from Chloe and Max. Talk to Chloe. But I don't want to talk to Chloe just yet. I almost want to sit down. 
But I'm afraid that'll lead to talking to Chloe. I really kind of want to listen to the message. But I'm afraid that'll bring up some things that we don't need to discuss, possibly. And obviously, we need to talk to Chloe. Is sitting on the couch just going to be a thinking moment, possibly? Or is it going to progress the story? Move over. Oh, no. I may have missed my spot. Nope. Okay, it's a thinking spot. Thank God it's a thinking spot. Anything to say, Max? Or is this going to be just me monologuing here? So, I'm assuming <gasps> the comic's still on the dining on the counter there of Chloe and Max. That's awesome. But uh, I wish this moment. Could oh, it took you long enough to start monologuing. Yeah, I'm afraid that this is the moment that William died, the day that William died. That's a great shot. Um, which means that he left to go pick up Joyce, and that message might actually be not what we think it is. But I'm going to find out. Before we talk to Chloe. Alright. I'm a little bit hungry. How about you? I'm okay. Uh, yeah. Wait, we never looked at this. You always make so much more of a mess here than at my house. Yeah. Manga might be the one thing where Chloe outnerds me. <laughs> I love how Polaroid cameras make every photo look a little nostalgic. Looks pretty good. All right, wait, there's no. That was a good. One. All right, we did that already. Okay. I used every possible. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Here goes nothing. Ah, yeah. Uh oh, what'd you do to Jeez. This needs to be addressed. Oh, what? Are you serious? I don't want my parents to hear that. I've never gotten in trouble like this before. They already know. I um I snoop I a lot. <laughs> I'm looking out for your best interest here, Chloe. Talk it out. Let's figure it out. Her mom is exaggerating. I bet Marissa told her that I... Marissa. I'm not able to place her name, but I face to the name. So I don't think that she was an original character. They both sound awful. You've got to tell me. Come on. You've got to tell me what happened. I'm your best friend. Man, none of this would have happened if I had you around. I wouldn't care what anyone said. What did she say? Sorry. I don't mean it's your fault. Of course not. I'll take it that way. Anyway, she wouldn't leave me alone, so I turned up her Bunsen burner inside. It's just a little. What? <laughs> no one got hurt. Not even close. You know that I know what I'm doing. Oh, yeah. I know. Chloe. You're a master of science. What do you mean she wouldn't leave you alone? She was making fun of my clothes and on the scholarship camp. I thought. Is that okay? Why you wanted to throw away your hoodie? Don't worry. I'll keep it. Ah, okay. You can handle this. Hey, you can handle this. You're so much cooler than she is. <laughs> Just to you. <laughs> Thanks, Max. Anytime. I'll get out. Nope. Okay. 